so hello everyone today i will show you uh, a project okay so recently i uh, enrolled in a uh, internship the company name is and i'm not logged in okay so let me log in first i i can show you the company okay let me so <clears throat> I enrolled as an intern uh, in Monster Developer. Okay, so I worked for React Monster. Okay, uh, you can see this. I post this. Uh, the company is this Zodio Development. This is the company. I applied for uh, three months and I properly completed i completed their tasks and that they have taken and this is the project final project that i made i post this in uh, linkedin so i will show you the whole structure okay how i executed this project and uh, first check the website okay so this is the website this is a cool loading I deployed this in Vercel. So this is the full stack e-commerce website. Okay. You can see here. I can control all this from <clears throat> admin panel. This is the home page. This Firefox is lagging. Let me open in Chrome. Okay. Open in this. The network is to okay. Still loading really badly. I don't know the reason. But they are loading properly. Okay, okay. So first login. This is the authentication page that I made, and this is the create user. It will work well. And I already have account. So here I used Clark authentication for the <coughs> authentication purpose and i have role where success one is admin and one is user so this user is admin okay so this is the profile thing here you can change your uh, avatar and this is the detail section i already added those information this is the order uh, that I already ordered. This is the address, this is the wish list, this is the payment details, and all of these. And this is the, uh, this all the product. So, first check the categories. Here, are the all categories, you can filter uh, all categories. Let uh, order one product. Let's do that to cut. Network is open. Yes, this is cut added successfully. And so I can see I remove one. Okay. So basically, the uh, product price, original price is 500. Sorry, 500. Yes. And 21% of the uh, payable price is uh, 3. Uh, 395 and uh, delivery charge is for uh, 49 rupees. Delivery charge will, will include when 
and the price is uh, under thousand and click to proceed i have three type of option one is cash on delivery one is uh, online payment and uh, one is uh, half cash and half online so first go with the uh, cash on delivery click to processing it will process and the order placing properly you can see here one item 27 june if i click to the details of the order you can see here initially the order status is processing i can control the status of the product from admin panel so let's access the admin panel this is the admin panel and here you can see many stats over here so first come to the order section uh let's filter it by processing i have one order 27 june uh, 12 10 am so right now i made this order uh because of this order is uh in uh cash on delivery that's why the amount is showing unpaid okay so i can change the status from here i can shift the order if i click to the mark as a shift it will shift so let me check yes it is shipped properly now also i can uh, mark as a deliver but amount will be unpaid still okay this is a mark as deliver check here this is market deliver now you can read this product okay and uh, still the payment is unpaid also you can paid from here let's make one order again uh, my size is well add to cart go to cart and now i will choose the online channel when i click to the person it will redirect to stripe page i used here stripe payment provider you can see here ah, and cv for this is the testing card and when i click to the pay it will uh, pay properly and it will verify the uh, order to this route value validity verify success is equal to true and you can see this is the order that i uh, currently made this is the order the amount is uh 3949 and there don't have any uh delivery charge because this, uh, this order is above a uh, thousand so also i can check this order from my admin panel okay this is the order that i recently uh doing <coughs> Initially, the status is as usual processing. I can click to the mark as shift and also mark as deliver. This is the online paid. Uh, uh, the status is paid uh, uh, and delivered, and the uh, method is online. This worked well. And also, the same thing for the half cash and then a half online. The same thing let's uh, discover the, this route this is the search i have a bmtn t-shirt so let's search it will work properly and now explore the uh, admin panel this is the admin panel uh, there are product section you can add product also edit product this is the regular uh, functionality of a e-commerce this is the collection i have uh, right now two collection here you can edit this collection and you can add product within this collection uh, the uh, currently i have five product in this collection i also delete like this and i also add and from there i update i can update the uh, collection here and it will work properly here the categories that listed uh, here i have i think two or four okay one is 69 percent one is 21 percent great this is the order page uh, from there you can uh, update the status and generate invoice and all of this and 
uh, last this is the customer page and this is the inventory uh, you can manage the inventory from here uh, if i click to the one inventory you can uh, change the stocks of each size okay if i uh, increase the stocks like 200 stocks i have uh, the l size i can update yes i think it will update okay it is updating properly the notification is not showing i'll check this is a bug from here and the settings section the in the uh, home page you can show you see here the banners i can control those those banners from uh admin panel you can see here i have three banners i will i can add more and the each banner will uh, pointing to a, a link uh, redirect path you can also change from here the exclusive product that's showing here i can change this from uh, admin panel okay new arrivals and all of this i hold the uh, i can hold the customizable the admin panel and this is the admin panel and this is the project and you can access this project uh, within my repository give this repo a start and you can access the whole code run and go through okay don't copy this project okay uh, fork and uh, analyze accordingly don't copy and paste okay so that's it for the today comment down below if i will show my more projects like that Goodbye.